welcome back to another Tuesday quick and easy video I gotta tell you guys I caught the Halloween bug and I'm so ready to decorate my house and I'm going to start by decorating my front porch uh, and I'm going to be making two signs that are going to say trick-or-treat and I'm going to be making them out of picture frames from Dollar Tree and they're gonna be very very easy to make so let's get started with the video So the very first thing I'm going to do is make my stencils, uh, which I already did, but I just wanted to show you how I accomplished this. Um, I do have large stencils, but at this point in my life, <laughs> I am not as organized as I used to be and I cannot find them. I haven't seen them in a long time actually. But anyway, but if you run into the same problem as me or if you just don't wanna pay for expensive stencils, you can just go ahead and print them out and then cut them out with your scissors. And you don't have to actually print out the whole word treat because you can repeat the letters T and the letter R, okay? So very easy. For this project, you are going to need 10 A by 10 picture frames from Dollar Tree, and you are going to need five per sign. So one for trick and one for treat. I'm going to take all of the content out from the frames, but do not throw anything away because you are going to need it. Now I'm going to be making the background for my picture frame, which is going to be black poster board also from Dollar Tree. And I'm going to be using the inside, the paper that came inside the frame as my template. And I'm just going to trace it and I'm going to make 10 of them. tracing my paper stencil over my glass and to make that happen I'm going to be using two paint markers a thin point and a thicker point and my thin point let's see if I can focus there you go so this one is going to uh, trace it around and the thicker one is going to be to fill it in and they are both from Walmart of my letters to be in the inside of the glass instead of the outside let me give you an example okay this is in the outside where I traced it but I want them in the inside as so okay and since I want that on all of my letters that means that I'm going to have to trace some of my letters backwards okay the letter T and the letter I are the same either way, so it doesn't matter, but for the rest of the letters, I'm going to have to trace them backwards. Now I'm gonna go ahead and make the rest of the letters and I'll be right back. Now I'm going to be gluing my frames together with E6000. with my other five frames and then I'm gonna let them dry for 24 hours. And lastly, I'm going to place all the content back in into the frames and I'm going to start with the glass. is it this is my trick-or-treat sign that I'm going to use at my front porch to start decorating for Halloween it was very easy to make it is a little time-consuming with the you know tracing the letters but totally cheap this was only $12 compared to you know the actual signs that you will find at the store made out of wood it will cost you an arm and a leg so for 12 bucks this is absolutely amazing 
All right, guys, I hope you like. Oh, and by the way, you are not gonna see a decked out front porch <laughs> because I'm just starting to decorate. So as the weeks go by, I'm going to start decorating and you know, make it look really nice. But for now, this is the start. All right, guys, until next time, bye. Why don't you have any shoes on? <laughs> How do you like? It's beautiful. <laughs> nice trick. 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 Okay, because he sounded like a bad word. The trick word. Okay, so there's trick. Or treat. Nice. You. Yep. Chickadee.